how whitetails communicate? While they do have a wide variety of vocalizations or noises they make, the main way is through smell. Whitetail deer have scent glands on their body and from these they secrete strong substances. These scents are known as pheromones and are one way a deer communicates with another deer. So, where are these glands located? White-tailed deer have scent glands between the two parts of the hoof and on all four feet, outside of each hind leg, and on the inside of each hind leg. Forehead scent that comes from the sudoriferous glands is located between the antlers and is used as a dominance and as a recognition scent. Before the rut begins, many bucks will actually sniff and lick each other on the forehead, where they will learn the smell of each other. This social behavior is good until the rut begins and fighting for territory takes over. A buck will often rub a tree limb with its forehead, which leaves a scent from the glands around its antlers. This is a signal to other bucks of its dominance, and occurs during the rutting season in the fall. The other deer may recognize the more dominant buck from the smell and stay away. There are literally dozens of different scents you can buy to cover or attract deer. But think about this. If you use the scent of a dominant buck, you may actually scare a buck away from your area or draw them in for a fight. That's this week's Wow Factor. Have fun.